Okay, straight into it. What up, what up? Welcome back to the Sneaker History Podcast. Got the whole crew. Gonna do a little uh a little my starting five, a little okay, live chat, action. Thanks. Make sure you're subscribed to us on Twitch, on YouTube. Uh, if you're listening to this, there's a much better visual aspect to the content that we're offering now. So <laughs> make sure you uh, connect to us on a on a more modern, uh, div- I, I guess it's not a device. Medium. Yeah. Medium. Platform. There you go. Thank you. Platform. 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 Look at our beautiful faces all day, guys. Come on. We're worth yeah, looking at exactly. sometimes. Exactly. But anyway, how you guys doing? I mean, besides being elbow deep in poop, I'm cool, you know? <laughs> like, it's just like, what else do I say? Like, I'm cool, though. <laughs> uh, yeah, I was thinking about your situation, Mike, and it was one of those things where you want to avoid the blowout whenever you're playing sports. And now being a dad, you also want to avoid that blowout as well. So, well, reflexes have gotten quicker. I didn't think I can't get any faster. No, nope, you see it coming. No, nope, diaper, <laughs> cover it. No, don't get on me. Gravity. Uh, but sometimes you lose that battle. You look down, you're like, I'm covered in poo right now. That's what's up. <laughs> Man, that's that's birth control right there. That's like I'm gonna have a second car <laughs> before I get shit on. Like literally. It's cool though. It's worth it though. They're 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 fun. Just you know, it's not that awesome where you're like, there's literally crap on me. But other than that, it's like they're they're cool. I'm basically wearing this maternity dress, so I'm like ready to have a kid. <laughs> so let's do this. <laughs> oh man. All right, so uh, I guess like let's uh, let's let's I guess we set the tone. So this episode we're gonna do the third signature shoe, which I had to think a little bit harder on this one than mm-hmm. normal. So uh, I don't know. I'm ready for it though. I feel pretty good, pretty confident. We got a lot of good options out there on the board. And, Question. Uh, can we just do five? Can we not do a sixth man in, in the interest of like, there's not a lot of third I shoes? Was, I was going to ask, can we do threes? Because I thought that that <laughs> pool was shallow. Three threes? <laughs> Three threes? Ooh. I mean, I say we do five and then okay, maybe maybe some honorable mentions that we forgot, right? Uh, fair enough. The sixth man. But this basically came to my head because of the Giannis shoe, right? The Freak Three, which Robbie despises, I love. Which is also the perfect dynamic for this podcast, and uh, yeah. So, Mike, row it. You guys want one? You guys want to run through the uh, the rules here real quick? Yeah, I'm sure. go for it. All right. So we do it fantasy football style snake draft, where we will have one person who starts, and the first and last person will go twice, and we will pick five. Uh, once it's off the board, it is gone. And I'm guessing for this particular instance, we're going model and not colorway, correct? So once it's off the board. I can't say this in a different colorway, right? Mm-hmm. Correct. All right. So we're off the board on that. And um, how are we picking order today, guys? We always struggle with this part, so I'm going to find a random number generator. We'll keep talking, guys. All right. So things and stuff. So <laughs> well, go ahead. We're gonna we're gonna we're gonna leave. Uh, like, there, there's there's multiple variations of what a third signature shoe is, right? So if a player had two shoes with one brand and then swapped to another, or oh. potentially, no. well, I was wondering about that. No, you can brand. do that. I I thought that'd be cheating, but in the interest of limited, you know, real estate in terms of shoes to choose from, that'd work. <laughs> I'll allow it. I'll allow it. Perfect. Mine, mine are all fucking thoroughbreds. <laughs> oh, here we go. Here, this is how we're starting it out. Already, that. already. Robbie, you go four. I'll go three. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> Just for that. Uh, Robbie, you go four. I'll go three. Nick, go two. Mike, go one. Cool. All right. All right. We ready to go? Let's do it. All right. I mean, just because I have to for the purpose of who we are and what our, our group shoe is. I have to pick the Jordan three as my first shoe off the board. Well, right. duh. Good I mean, like, yeah. if I so, didn't, I feel like Robbie would come beat me up. I mean, exactly. I think Robbie would run you over with those thoroughbreds that he's. <laughs> <laughs> so if you, if you, if you don't know what a Jordan three is and you're new to everything sneakers, I threw one up on the screen for you to check out. But anyway, uh, yeah. So I'm up next. I'm ready for this. Go for it. I pulled it out of the closet. 
Uh oh. Re Reebok answer three. There it is. That was one of my. <laughs> I swear I thought you said Alan three. <laughs> that's actually a good shoe. Like it's a very good shoe. shoe. Yeah, it's a, it's a, yeah, it's a great shoe. I mean, this is a this is a little dirty and a little beat what? up, but you know. Back to the war room. Scratch off that off my list. <laughs> All right. I mean, Mike, you got the first pick. There's no scratching off for you as far as I'm concerned. That's right. Fine, that's fine. You scratch yeah. off on your own time in the bathroom. Yeah. Alone. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> <Talk about it. laughs> well, yeah. Well, I'm up next, and I will go with the T Mac 3 for. Oh, for damn you. <laughs> Man. That's that definitely one. one of mine as well, though. I'm not going to lie. Yep. Man. <laughs> So, I have to go with the LBJ3. It legitimately is one of my favorite shoes in the line. Tank. Uh, the classic or the Zoom Soldier? No, Ooh. yeah, no. This, this, the normal LeBron 3. I'll, I'll leave the Soldier for other people. Just the metal aglets and then the metal um, lace tips. What's funny is, no, the aglet is the lace tip. Um, uh, right. The eyelet. Yeah. The eyelet's the, the both metal eyelet and aglet. So they slam together when you walk. You Man, it's so it. damn loud. Yeah. <laughs> I love that shoe though. It's super patty and cushiony. It's a, it's a good one. Oh, okay. now. Oh, so great shoe. Still, we're still leaving the shoulder, the soldier three on the board though. Correct. Soldier three is still on Z board. I don't right, love cool. the soldier three as much as Nightwing or other people. <laughs> It's it's not it's good not my thing though. What All I right. am gonna have to do though, it's a toss up between the Kyrie three and Vince Carter three. Ooh. I'm going Vince Carter though. Artist deduction, hose jump like Vince Carter. Okay. I bought J Cole tickets in October. I'm really excited. <laughs> but um, yeah, Vince Carter three. I'd even yeah any colorway. They're all it's like that's literally just memories. Like Vince Carter to ever have seen play top three players in my book. It's like most amazing top. Yeah, I can go top whatever. Vince Carter is top, top blank, top this is Vince. There we go, baby. Ooh. That is a beautiful shoe. I forgot about that one. God damn, it's a good looking shoe. I think we did another list and somebody said Vince. I didn't. Somebody didn't say Vince Carter and Nick. I think you brought up Vince Carter, and that's that stuck with me. I'm like, I'm bringing up Vince this time. I back. love that shoe. I can't, mess, I can't mess with the shocks. Can't do it. No, they're they're awful. But shocks. just the nostalgia <laughs> and the design, man, the player. Now these kids don't know. Uh, so it's funny you mentioned the Kyrie three, Robbie, because that was the debate I was having with myself. And I'm gonna go with the aforementioned Zoom threes, but I'm really hoping that the Kyrie threes. Uh, Stay there until my next pick, but for my official pick, I'll go Zoom Soldier Threes. Soldiero. Soldiero. All right. All right. I'm back up. Yeah. Yep. All right. Uh, I am. Uh, I'm going to. I mean, I don't even know if Robbie's going to hate me for this, but uh -oh. I'm going to. I'm going to just, just gonna do it. What, what else can I do? You know? Do it on him. Do it. Do it. Is this like the Minnesota Vikings where you're going to run out of time? There we go. Oh. <laughs> oh. Kobe 3, Adidas. Clever guy. Ah, man, Clever. I wish this shoe would have released. Happy. I wish this shoe would have released. This is by far my favorite Kobe Adidas shoe. Hands down. The Batman Lowe's is what I call them. That's like a Batman shoe. It's Batman oh. Lowe's. <laughs> that's, that's, oh, man. I wouldn't even think about picking that one. But uh, the... I'm gonna stick in the same vein. I'm gonna go with the Nike Kobe three, as uh, as my pick. And then I guess I go again. Yes, you do. And I thought that would slip more. The Kobe three. I know it's a performance I love juggernaut. A lot of people love playing in it. That shoe's fucking ugly. I do. I love Awful. how ugly it is. It's so ugly that it's good to me. I'm trying to give Nick a second to pull it up. Are you gonna pull it up? I was. I was trying to find of it. Hold on. As Nick is going, and so the prelude pack. Pick the prelude pack one because that's like the most beautiful color of it. Let people know. No, get the MVP. Now let people know the one let, time. Let them know the one time for the one time. One time for the one time. Any more for any more. <laughs> so, Mike, how are you feeling? Because you were probably the most vocal about your picks being taken away from you. Are you in a good, no, better place? Good. I'm in. A, I'm in a better place. I've come down off my uh, 
my streamism. I'm, I'm, I'm back. <laughs> Fair enough. All right, well, I'll try and give Nick a chance to pull it up, but I'll go to my uh, my third pick for the sake of time. And oh, look at that! Perfect there timing. she blows. There it is. Bum, bum, bum. So th it is beautiful though. The shank is so little. That, I mean, yeah, the the trigger, the heel trigger, is so little. It's a really cool design cue, but just man, that shoe's ugly. Love it, man. I don't know, that's a Ken Link, I think. I believe. Uh, let me. I think that's the that's the last Ken Link design from the Kobe line before Avar took it over. Yeah, oh. I think so. Sorry, Ken. <laughs> Sorry about you, bro. <laughs> um, no, 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 no. So, next one, I am actually going to go kind of off the beaten path. I just kind of really like the shoe for some reason. Just haven't bought it. But I'm going to go with the Yeezy three fit or Yeezy seven hundred V three. That's judges? A signature, right? Hey, I mean, totally are, we allowing this? are we allowing this, judges? Oh, yeah, we are. Yeah, that, that's a version three. That's that's a third one. That totally counts. Yes. I didn't think of it, but like it literally has three in the name. <laughs> I'll, uh, variant three. So that's that's kind of crazy because I didn't even think about Kanye's being a, a thing, right? Like what's wild is like, are they their own lines? 300 700 350 500. I, don't think so. I mean that'd be like the soldier and then the yeah. ambassador and then the whatever yeah. you know pick one i agree with that that's that cool. shoe was that shoe's gorgeous though i mean i love I, that I, shoe. I think a lot of the the kanye stuff i just feel weird about buying shoes from him more than anything because it tends to have a little too much uh meaning it beats the beast yeah <laughs> but um I think you're up next, Nick. All right. Uh, what? Oh, 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 I'm uh -oh, ready uh -oh. for this. I'm ready for this. Y'all are definitely not ready for this, though. Let's see here. The S, Costin 3. Oh, uh, deep cut. All right. Deep, deep cut. Inspired by the Air Jordan 12. Yep. One of my favorite skate shoes of all time. Probably my second favorite Costin shoe behind the Costin 1. Nice. I We're gonna have a couple Google. skate shoes in this list, but that's I, think so. I definitely thought I definitely Googled the cost and stuff from S. As, as yep. did I. And I was hoping to pick that up as an honorable mention or a six man, but well done, Nick. Uh, I guess I'm up next and I will go with the aforementioned Kyrie three. I just really like certain colorways of it, especially that Mamba mentality. That's probably <laughs> one of the 15 most beautiful shoes I've ever seen, just based on the color, based on the detail. I could wax poetic about it. I think I have in previous episodes, but yeah, I feel very happy with my pick. Good stuff. That's a good one. All right, Robbie, you get the twofer. I have a lot of Kyrie threes. I love that shoe, man. It's a great That's shoe. Cool. Yes. Um. So this next one, the naming convention is just really dumb. I think they cleaned it up in recent years, but the D Lil D Lillard three by Adidas, Damian Lillard three. Here's why I like it. It has this really cool, awkward upside down like l7 weenie <laughs> shape going on between like, like a the rectangle or a 90 degree yeah so like there's a line coming up from the midsole to like this plastic plate where the lacing can happen it's like customizable lacing and then it has like a triangle design towards the heel oh, yeah, there's really cool weird lines really cool weird tongue his logo i love that logo the d with the wings Yep. He used to be a dunker. I mean, Dame can still dunk, but now he's known for just like jacking it up from 40. But Dame has a lot of athleticism and the little wings on the logo. That was really cool. I believe they had bounce in them. Uh, I never had a pair, but I, I, weirdly enough, I was at like some sneaker event in Portland and somebody had a whole bunch of Dame three PEs. And I remember just holding them each in hand, like different universities and you know, blazer exclusives and it's like damn this is so sick and I, i've never owned a pair but definitely a really unique weird weird shoe but i, I like it oh. um this next one the p-rod three by nike ah, well done nice nicely played the black and red colorway the white and black it doesn't matter that's just such i don't know it's like i'm not really into skate shoes that aren't I don't even like Nike SBs really that much anymore. Um, 
it's for me it's more of like the tongue gets in the way not a huge fan but with these i don't know p rod's just like I was, i've been playing tony hawk let's put it that way <laughs> who's your I have, uh, i approve that i got the tony hawk remake it's yeah. like I like quilting. The only time I've ever loved the two is when it has like the Don C quilt. I like how some of the twos, pardon me, some of the threes have that kind of quilt pattern on the quarter panel. Mm -hmm. um, there's, a, there's a cool shoe, man. Very, very cool shoe. All right. Um, love that pick, Robbie. I think I'm up next. So, yeah, I'll go off the beaten path. Give me the Fila 97s, which were the Grand Hill 3. I'm kind of going off that signature line that we had drafted previously. I realized how much I love the Grand Hill line as a whole, and then I saw that he got a lifetime deal with Fila. So, Grant, why don't you go ahead and throw some of your boys away? I know I tend to be team swoosh over everything, but I would not mind some Filas in the old uh, mailbox. So, That's a cool shoe I forgot existed. That, that was on my list. Thanks, Rowett. <laughs> You're welcome. Put up here real quick. I didn't. Get, I I didn't get a chance to go through and grab everything out of the garage that I wanted. So, uh, Fila. Man, there's a black and white Fila '97. Looks yeah. really good. Yep, it's a beautiful yep. shoe. It's really, really a nice shoe. Um, I'm back up. Yes. Yep. I'm gonna. I'm gonna. I'm gonna go a little. A little. Uh, a little modern on you guys. I haven't seen this shoe in person yet, but <laughs> just strictly based off of the pictures, I'm super into it. Uh, Do it. The Don issue three. Okay. Wow. That is clean. That is I a love, very nice shoe. I think like Adidas, I mean, this, the Trey Young shoe, mm -hmm. Dame stuff. I think Adidas basketball is super underrated right now. I gotta say it. I like it. I like it. A lot of people are stoked on like the, the the cut GT and all these like Nike basketball man. It's it's been the same thing. They they know what works and just been repackaging it for a long time. Adidas stuff looks unique. Mm -hmm. Like it has flavor to it. It's like damn. If I want really good mashed potatoes, I'm gonna go to Nike basketball. <laughs> if I want like garlic fries with like kimchi mayo on the side, Ooh. let me that some of that Adidas basketball. And I'm hungry. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I can smell the food I cook. I didn't eat it yet. I'm like, man, this all smells good. Thanks. Thanks, uh, Rob. You're making me hungrier. My bad. Uh, all right. Mike, you're up. I, yeah, it's my turn. So, two piece. Two piece. Number one is going to be the Nike I think Air Griffey Max 3. It is the one with the diagonal strap across all leather. Looks basically based completely off the cleat. Love that shoes. One of the, the first, you know, the shoes I remember having as a kid, and I just more nostalgia for me. <laughs> and to finish me off here, I'm going to D Rose three. One of my favorite players. I uh, love the D Rose lineup to about, you know, four models in. D Rose three will finish finish it off for the day. Damn it, Mike! <laughs> Look, I even had that one pulled out. Yeah, dude, it's a clean <laughs> shoe. Such a You're ready such for a it. Shoe. Um. All right, so. Uh... Shoot, that was that was I was I was invested in the rose line, man. <laughs> All right, um, what do we got left here? James Harden. Oh, there's plenty of options. Yeah. That yeah, shoe was, was garbage. Was I had stuff. that shoe. That shoe was absolute garbage. Zoom Freak Three, Nick, make it happen. <laughs> AKA the KD Seven, same shoe. I mean, so KD Three, Paul I George wanna, Three. I kind of want to. I kind of want to, but. I think I got to go with the KD3 because yep. the KD3 right. in like the in that bright ass yellow colorway mm -hmm. stoplight. I mean, stoplights. Yeah, the stoplight bag because it was a Grinch or something. Yep. Right? Yeah. Same and, same time and the day. and the red pair that he wore at All Star, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's like super, like I don't know, translucent or something. Washington Redskins like. PE scoring titles. It was a lot. And I I had the Washington Redskins PE and I let it go. Man, that's a fuck up. That shoe's beautiful. <laughs> Why to make him feel better? <laughs> that's, what, that's what he wore at Rucker Park, right? I believe that's what he wore at the Rucker was his Washington Redskin. Oh, I didn't realize that. P. I might that's be wrong. Man. All right. Where we at? I think I'm up next, and I will go with the Nike Vic 3s for Michael Vick. That's a great pick. 
I really like oh, the Vic. Oh man, too. I didn't even think about those. Nope. Yeah, I'm man. Just, <laughs> everything that guy did, unfortunately, is going to be with the uh, darkest of clouds hanging over it, and rightfully so. But he's also shown a forgiveness and a willingness to better himself. So I figured the least I can do is show love to a sneaker that I think is probably underrated in a underrated sneaker line that I don't think will ever get its proper due because of the actions. Yeah. I don't, I don't know that we'll, yeah, I don't know. That's a, that's a killer shoe though. Sorry. That was a bad choice. I know it's all right. I made the joke that once Nike dropped him, he was signed by hush puppies and everybody just kind of looked at me. So, Oh, (laughs) I think that's funny. I'm sorry. I'm a cat person though. Yeah, that's true. Same. Um, Nobody's nobody's gonna go Paul George. Nobody's gonna go. Um, when have I ever been known to say anything Paul George? I have to admit, I have the NASA Paul George threes back there, and I love wearing that shoe. It looks fantastic. The motif is great, but I'm not picking it either. I'm going with. (laughs) It was an honorable mention just because of that colorway. This shoe here's a longevity pick. Here's a pick. That you could still buy at CCS today, and oh. I'm kind of interested in buying them to be a poser. But the <laughs> America Reynolds three, baby, that was the shoe of like freshman year. Maybe it was more middle school, but like that was the cool shoe growing up. Like, I oh seen my god, either. we got a picture of Nick. And I, I can't remember what it looks like. Yeah, I got one. Hang on. And uh, I've been playing Tony Hawk, and he's in the game. Who's your character, by the way, Robbie? Yeah, I I gotta say, who's your main, Robbie? We asked you this earlier. Who's my what? Who's your main character that you play with? Or you go create oh, a skater? Robbie Falcon. I made him up. <laughs> Duh. Dude, right now, I'm between Kareem Campbell all the time and Nigel because he's just the god of skateboarding right now. Rune Glifberg for me. Christ Air little... back in the day? Yeah, listen. Christ <laughs> Air basketball jersey? He checked a lot of boxes for you. Boy. But I'm speaking good. of Nigel, man. Mike, thank you for bringing visibility to the U.S. skateboarding. I guess what do we call it? Is it a kit? Is it a oh, jersey? I'm, the, I'm, I'm calling every favor from everyone on our Discord. Damn I don't it. care what country. I just yeah. need as many of those kits as possible. I'm replacing all my soccer jerseys with those. I fell in love with every one of those shirts today. Beautiful. Yes. Beautiful. Yep. Yep. They I. Robbie. Hey, 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 hey. Uh, <laughs> yeah. hey, 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 hey. Too easy, said Muska 3's. Can, can, can you hold the baby inside that shirt? I don't think so, dude. I That's mean, if I got a big enough size, I could. Early 2000s Reebok. Yo, we you know. see my, I got my, my, my pack right here mm. ready to go. Baby drop in. <laughs> Lock it in. It's like a bulletproof vest. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, I think I think so. So Todd said in the in the chat. The Muska threes, that's a good one. Yep. I don't know why you guys, oh, yeah. you know, I, I'm the Chris Paul hater, so I, I wasn't going to bring up the CP3 threes. Or that's the, 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 one. The, the four was three, good. The CP3 three was the one that they did, like, the true blues and the cements and all that stuff, though. Yeah. So I thought Is, sure somebody would bring it up. Was that the one also that had, like, a voodoo colorway for, like, New Orleans? Because I did like that. I'm trying to remember if that was oh, That was the two. That was the Mardi Gras. That was the Chris uh, yes. Paul Thank you. Now, um, Thank you. Mellow threes. I, Mellow the L- threes. The M3, the M3 was a good one we missed. Uh, Dion, the DT Max is because they didn't even call him a three. Oh, I forgot about that. Rodney one. Mullen Globe, the Mullen three. Oh. From Globe. That's good. Uh, yeah. let's see. Make that shoe. It's crazy. They still make a lot of those skate shoes. Like they don't ever go out of style. Nobody picked yep. a peak Tony Parker three. I refuse to do anything Spurs related. Thank you. That's weird, Mike. You're the biggest Spurs fan I know. That's absolutely just... not. As my other half is, but not not me. <laughs> Can I just make my Tony Hawk joke? Because Tony Hawk versus Robbie Falcon. Robbie Falcon's gonna beat Tony Hawk <laughs> every time. Does a Falcon beat a, a Hawk? I think so. Like, uh, I think IRL. On the size, right? I don't. <laughs> uh, I'm trying to remember what the Animorphs said because I think one of the Animorphs was stuck as a Hawk, but. The leader was the Falcon, so in my mind, the yeah. Falcon trumps the Hawk. I mean, White Falcon uh, Megazord, so I mean, you went on that just automatically. Right. Conversely, Lord. one of the corniest nicknames ever, Harrison Barn in the Black Falcon, which I think contributed to the fact that he turned into a role player. Had he not given himself <laughs> a crappy nickname, he might have had a thing. But right now, he's what, American Andrew Wiggins? Oh. Hold on. Could we have put um, 
No, I just lost to shoot my brain. I had it there. Yeah, it's Dirty gone. Three. We totally DC missed, Dirty yeah. Three. The Dirty Three. We missed the yeah. Air Tech Challenge Three. Yeah. Oh Probably. God, what is wrong? Yeah, with I thought Nick would have that. I thought Nick would do the tennis. I forgot. You missed the, the Barclays. Oh man. Way Wade Three. I actually like that one. Way Wade Threes. Yeah. KG Three. KG Three. Hey Mario. Oh, <laughs> This wow, is, we, this uh, is why we, we need to think about this. Kiss so, Kiss. this is this is a this is an argue, this is a uh, reason for us to actually think about this a little longer than the text message an hour before. Like, <laughs> hey, what are y'all doing? You want to go? You want to do a, an episode? <laughs> We're I procrastinators, all right. Look, we do it seven we do. hours ago. I came I, I came ready seven hours ago, and I still forgot about KG three. It's damn. Yeah. No one said three. How did no one say three? Robbie mentioned it. Yeah. Earlier, mention when he, when oh, okay. He, it was, it, it was in the same breath of trashing Paul George, though, so I think it just got swept Oh, I got lost and technically I has two lines, right? Because the answer and yeah. the question are two different. Yeah. 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 Answer three is kind of ugly. Though. Nah, not answer. The question three is kind of ugly. No, question yeah. three is what you picked. You, what, yes. what did you pick? Oh, he, picked, he picked answer oh, three. Answer three is what I picked. That's so what I thought. The question three, three is the question is three is uh is like the newer version, right? Yeah. Like, it might be like a legacy colorway, huh? Yeah, I can't remember what it looks like exactly because it's something weird. It's like a mashup of twenty different things. It looks like the answer eleven. Here, I'll pull it. Okay, maybe that's what it is. White Ranger Tiger Power. Like my head hey, on. don't play around. I got a sword on my wall. I can pull it down right now for you. You got the flute though, the dagger flute. No, I had a choice. It was man, it's a hard decision. It was like the lesser... you didn't go with the dude. I, I had to go with the with the sword, bro. I got it. I get it. It was tough, tough choices though. I'm not gonna lie. I, I cried a little bit afterwards. Yeah, that was an ugly shoe. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> it's it's definitely not. I mean, I like the answer eleven, but it 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 just feels like they were forcing it so much to be something that it wasn't with this one. I don't even know when they dropped that shoe because that would have been like probably oh. about the same time as the eleven too. So I can't remember if it was. Uh, hmm. He Ooh. played it. He played in it though because he played in it. In a he has he like a thanks a thanks uh, Philadelphia version that was uh, like a PE, but it it definitely was not the greatest. Uh. The <laughs> Calvin Johnson Trainer Three. That's actually a good looking shoe. I forgot to bring that up. Wow, yeah. Megatron. The Mike Trout Three. Yep. Mm. Not to be confused with the Steve Bass. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> Steve Bass oh, is not real. Man. Well, it's probably a real man somewhere. But. All right, so sh should we run through them real quick so we can wrap? Let's yeah, do it. let's go ahead. Let me pull my list back out because I forgot what I picked. All right, I'm ready when y'all are. Lead us off, Mike. All right, so number one, Jordan, three. Number two, Kobe, three. Uh, number three, Yeezy 700 V3. Number four, Griffey, uh, Air Griffey Max, three. And number five, D Rose, three. Nick, I think you're up next. Hang on, I gotta, I gotta regroup. You got, okay. One of you guys I'll, will go. <laughs> I'll go ahead. Uh, I've got the T Mac threes as my first overall pick. Then the Zoom Soldier threes. Thank you, Robbie. Kyrie threes. Fila ninety sevens and the Nike Vic threes. Robbie, how about yourself? LeBron three, Vince Carter three. Um, I'll call them Ryan Reynolds, Eric Reynolds three, on um, the P Rod three, and the Dame three. D Lillard three. Yeah, I, I love that. Um, yeah, so I got the uh, Allen Iverson answer three, the S skateboarding Costin three, Adidas Kobe three, Adidas Don three, and the KD three. Not too bad. We missed a lot, but uh, yeah, let us know. Fun. Let us know your 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 top five third signature shoes. I mean, we we left probably a good dozen on the table, so there's plenty. If we don't see it in the comments, you know. I'd be super disappointed. If I don't remember, it didn't happen. <laughs> and memento style. I got a tattoo yeah. of my body. <laughs> a E C three. Yeah, I just feel like just a joke for getting about the air take challenge now. I'm just gonna sit in my corner and I cry. Know. Seriously, that the K the KG three yeah. man. Yeah, no, I'm with Robbie. I, I left that on the table thinking Nick would get it because he is senior Agassi expert Nick Engvall. But yeah, I don't know what to say. Oh, man. I brought these Kobe ones because I can only wear one shoe at a time. But nothing to do with this conversation. But it's a beautiful shoe. <laughs> I thought we just pull out random shoes. Nice. 
As you're wearing a T-Mac jersey. I love it. <laughs> Just like the right. grab of stuff. Yep. All right, guys. Well, uh, let everybody know where they can catch up with you online. Yep. You can find me on Instagram and Twitter at MadWatcher789. You can find me on YouTube at MadWatcher. Or, no, was, nope, nope. You can find me on YouTube at Mike Guillory. And then, of course, find me on Sneaker History. Excellent. You can find me on Instagram at RoadM13. You can find me on Twitter at Roheasy. Robbie, how about yourself? You can find me at Sneaker History. How about you, Nick? At Nick Ingvall on all the platforms. Catch you on the next episode. Peace. See ya.